Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded series. We are back again jumping in and oh my god, just a one streak. But anyways, let's just jump straight into it. Let's go, let's randomise and we get Job. A nice bit of Job. I love a Job run. Job runs are just fun. I think classic Job, not tainted. He's just so like vanilla. Like he doesn't, he doesn't have anything super crazy going on. Um, but yeah, I don't know. He's just, he's just a character that I feel that he's always fun to play. I mean... For me, having high fire rate is just always fun because high fire rate usually leads to um, more use of tier effects. So yeah, it's always it's always great to see. And I gotta say, Job is he's one of those modded characters that just so perfectly fits into the uh, nice little little, little Steven there. He just so perfectly fits into the way that the that the vanilla game plays. It's really good. So I'm pretty happy with that. Ooh, he's got like a new tier effect. It's like a dogma tier. I like it. Uh, we also got a bomb there, we'll probably use it on that Tinted Rock. Also, I really like the fact that his um, Book of Despair, for one, is a pocket item, which is really nice. Obviously, not many of the base characters that aren't tainted, well, none of the base characters that aren't tainted have that ability. But also, the fact that his um, his book, you get the fire rate like for, for more than just the time that you use it. Like, more than just the room that you use it, sorry. I realised using it when I just did was maybe a little bit of a waste. Um, I maybe could have got all of that for one bomb, but oh well. We gotta get car battery. We've got to. We we absolutely have to. I will I will sacrifice my firstborn child to make sure we get car battery here. I'm hoping we just get like a pageant boy and we don't have to worry about it. But there is other ways that we can maybe get it. We'll have to see. I may be in a bit hasty with the money. I probably should have checked the shop first. But little Steven, such a good grab early on. My God, look how much damage this boy's doing. And obviously just. Having homing shot early is so nice. Um, oh god. Oh god. Um, but yes, here's, here's, uh, oh god. Here's the question for today. What's a conspiracy that you fully believe and no one can tell you otherwise? No matter how crazy or stupid it is. Mine isn't super out there. Um, like, I just, the whole stuff that happened with Epstein, I believe all the conspiracies about that, about, like, yeah. <laughs> him not killing himself sort of thing. Um... That, they're not, like, super out there. I think a lot of people believe those, but still. Uh, but it's always interesting to hear. Because uh, the thing is, as well, like, there's different conspiracy theories in different countries and things as well. So, it's always interesting to hear um, what people have to say. I made a huge mistake here. Okay. This was all sorts of bad, wasn't it? All sorts of bad. Right. One penny. Two pennies. Okay. 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 Hmm. It's kind of annoying because there's there's health right there. Oh, I don't know if we can do this. We do have an initial machine as well, which is the most annoying thing. I could have just bombed it. Had car battery. Wasted my two soul hearts, I've realized, but whatever. Right, what what's the uh what's the dealio here? Angel chance. Maybe I should go in like I I feel like I should maybe go in and get the lost doll the, the, the burnt dollar. Lose all your money on pickup, drops consumes proportion to the money lost whenever you finish a floor without money, gain damage. Now that we know we're not gonna get it, let's give this a go. Okay. This is exactly what I was hoping for. So now we can... I think this will reach both. If it doesn't, I'm going to be upset. Okay, good. Now we get this money here. This has to be the most roundabout way of this happening ever. But I feel like I've played this reasonably well. <laughs> and then we can do that. And now we have enough for car battery. <laughs> very, very roundabout way of grabbing it. But... This should make our Book of Despair even better, and any other actives we get even better on top of that. Uh, we're just going to the lamb here, we'll just go down. Ah, uh, yeah, that was it, unfortunately a waste of soul hearts. That was a pretty unfortunate secret room for that to all unfold in. Uh, not secret room, sorry, curse room. Um, ooh, starting the floor with no money gives us damage and a bunch of stuff. Okay, that's good. That's really good. But yeah, we'll see um, We'll see how we end up going with Book of Despair. I kind of want to make sure I'm at 5 cent increments with our money so that I can actually like spend enough to be at zero on the next floor. Because that seems pretty valuable. We got a lot of good stuff there. Oh, I did not want to pick that up. 
It's good, but I was going to go into my cash room first. So let's pop that. So did that pop twice? I can't tell. I think it did. I think it did. I don't think we were going up to seven fire rate before. Rather nice. So yeah, we're going to have crazy fire rate for the majority of this run now, which is always really nice. Hopefully we can get a devil deal here. Yeah, I think I'd take a devil deal with my current HP. And we even, it even carried over before the current amount of fire rate ran out. Beautiful. So yeah, what we'll do here is we'll go into our shop and see if we can, do pick that up. See if we can buy a soul heart. There you go. And that puts us at zero cent. Now, if we, um, unless there's a lot of money available to us, if we can avoid picking up any money for the rest of this floor, our burnt dollar is going to give us some nice rewards, including damage up, which I think the damage up is more important than anything else. Luckily, we are getting really, really good amounts of um, soul hearts, just generally here. But yeah, the fire rate is just lasting us so, so long. One of the most fun things about Joe, trying to keep that fire rate bonus going. We can do that. Come in here, 7.5 fire rate. Really? That guy's going to jump at me straight away like that. With this much fire rate, even with lower damage, you're just wrecking everything. All we need now is like a really good tier effect. So now we can grab that. Come in here. I, I actually think we should take everything here. More of the voids. So good. But yeah, now we're going to go down to the next floor. And it is going to give us another reward and some more damage up, which is super important. Uh, we got some chests. Nice. So we don't we don't want to pick up the money yet. We want to sort of see where we stand. Um, I think I'll take that. Uh, faster firing little Steven seems good to me. Especially if we can get that going. More of the void here, of course, is great. I, the main reason I took the active is because... Um, Ooh, what the hell's that? That's that's a re-sprited um, soul uh, trinket, I think. But yeah, um, the reason I took the, the active is because we get to use it twice every time. And it can give us devil deals. More of the void, obviously, I just took because it's insanely powerful. We got an item there, inner demons. That's, a, that's an on damage effect, so I don't think we really care about that for now. But yeah, we don't want to let Bent Dollar completely, like, take over. We, we, we do want to still be picking up money when it's relevant. But, like, only if we can pick it up in, like, five cent increments so we can guaranteed spend it per floor. Obviously, there is the chance we get a, a, a floor that doesn't have a shop, that just has, like, a greed fight, which throws a, a spanner in the works, I suppose. But otherwise, we're going to be fine. I'm not really looking for secret rooms in the minute. I'm kind of playing quite fast. I feel like this character, the fast fire rate just makes me want to play faster. I don't know why. Okay, so don't pick that up. Pop that down. Obviously, the more health we can get here is going to be the be uh, going to be better for us. Unfortunately, that's not going to be good. But we really ooh, planetarium. Wasn't expecting that. We really want to be getting a crazy amount of health so we can trade with our active. Okay, so we got found soul familiar that follows Isaac's exact movements. We'll definitely take that. Siren song's good, but this is better. And we get Jupiter. I'm going to see if I can get a reroll because I genuinely don't like Jupiter. Uh, just just because it's like, it's good, but it's it, I don't want the speed down. I, I'd rather have higher speed before doing that. Oh, I forgot this guy copies our more of the void effects as well. Wait, he uses our active also. This is crazy. <laughs> Okay, this is good. This is really good. Seems like 7.5 is our complete and utter limit for fire rate. Yeah, I don't think we're going to end up getting a reroll, but I have to, like, try. Because I'm not going to pick up Jupiter. I'm just not. I just don't like it. It's just, like, the worst planetarium item. The, the gas clouds just aren't very valuable. And the speed down is annoying when you don't have a speed up. If I manage to get a speed up from the boss, then maybe I'll change my mind. Also, remind me to never use that near a door. I haven't seen our item room yet, so I'm guessing that'll be back the other way. Oh my god, the double more of the void is so strong. So strong. Right, pop that again. Just keep our fire rate at the maximum. Basically, we're never going to not have seven fire rate. 
Okay, definitely don't use it in this room. Okay. Oh, I got a horse pill there. This is so beautiful to me. I think I'm gonna go back first and check if my item rooms over that way. I might be, I might end up being wrong, but it feels like it is over that way. Okay, make sure we don't go back through that door because that's gonna end up getting us hurt immediately. But this is this is a spicy active to have with a. Uh, I always forget that the little lost soul dude. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! The little lost soul dude copies your active as well. And like more of the void things like that. It's crazy how strong it is. We're still at zero cent as well. There's our item rooms, nice. And our shop as well. Burn heart there. Got a lot of money here. We'll definitely grab all that. Uh the D8 is unfortunately not what we need right now. Spinning wheel is interesting. We'll grab it. Um, whoa. What the heck's this? I think we'll plop, plop some bombs there. Okay, unfortunately not what we need. And we can go. Oopsie, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> That's why I said don't don't be a, a dildo and place theirs right next to a door, because I'm going to keep accidentally doing that, aren't I? The lovers. Okay. In a bit of a sticky situation in some regards here. I'm sorry, Jupiter. I just can't fathom to take you. You're not good enough. Oh, what did I say about not going through that door? You idiot. <laughs> I need to be very careful. My health is really bad right now. You fool. Okay. It's like he... I can, I can never sort of pin down exactly where to place the bomb. Well, there you go. Oh, ho, ho. that could have been so good. Right, this is good. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I was really hoping I'd sleep in the bed for soul hearts, but maybe if I get a devil deal, I can come back and do that. Blue map's really good to get here as well. I didn't even mention that. Spinning wheel here is pretty awesome. Especially with Booker Despair, we can get some crit. Great stuff going. Good thing about spinning wheel as well is we'll be doing we'll be firing it while we charge our more of the void, which will kind of be our main damage dealer. I do not like the idea of these, so I'm gonna try and pass by them. You are slightly annoying, but not terrible. Just don't throw bombs at me and I'll be okay. Okay. The more of the voids, just destroy him. There you go. Health, please. Thank you. <laughs> Very much needed that. Alright, let's charge up more of the void. I want to have more of the void, like, instantly ready for the boss, because it just does so much damage. And I think, like, three more, more of the voids, maybe two. Actually, yeah, probably, probably only two or one, even. We did a lot of damage with our tears, actually. What, what we could really use now is Herming. Herming would be, like, really top tier. Golden Flakes is going to give us a gold version of this trinket, which, if that gives me another ghost, it unfortunately doesn't. I'm a little upset about that. That would have been quite hilarious if it gave me another one of those. Um, We got ourselves a soul heart here. Gasoline isn't very good. Chance to deal three hearts of damage. Chance to spawn two devils from... Uh, two items from the devil pool. Three hearts of damage would put us in a really rough spot, so I can't I can't take that. Um, and I think we'll just go. This is quite a spicy build we've got going on now. Unfortunately, no use for those golden bombs, really, so we just got to get going. But there is some sauce. Oh, it spawns extra stuff for the little ghosty boy, too. Hell yes. Foiled Magician is nice. Judgment, you can go here. Okay, we got some good stuff going on. Just remember not to pick up money if we don't have to. This is amazing. Oh, did, did my little dude just pick up that health? Are you kidding me? I didn't know that could happen. <laughs> Why can he pick up HP? He 
You little troll. You gotta be careful of that. I didn't know that could happen. Right, do, make sure I don't pick up that penny. Magician. Did not mean to use the magician there. Went to use my book of despair. Oh my god. Look what I've done. Place it right next to the door. Again. Okay, we can get up to five cent here. I mean, I have to grab it, because I'm an idiot. It, it, it was a tears up, at least. Get up to 15 cent here, good. This is potentially good. Book of Shadows, Book of Belial, Book of Secrets. And we'll at least pop all of them. Uh, well, pick up them all. I think Book of Secrets... I don't know, this is so interesting, though. But I, I, like, it's, it's causing us such pain. Such, such pain. Oh, no. You can't have jumped immediately, dude. You serious? Oh, my God, no. Right, please don't be a thingy. Okay. It does have a 15 cent item, but unfortunately I'd rather have the one that isn't 15 cent, but I have to buy this one. Center of the room. Okay. Need more HP right now, though. That is our primary concern right now. Okay, good. Pop those down. I mean, yeah, why not? Oh, what? I picked up money. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Okay, I've got seven cent now, though, which means that I can actually go and spend that seven cent. This is a really interesting way to play. I've, I've never really... I've, I've had the burnt dollar a bunch of times before, but I've never really played to it. Um... Yeah, I've never really played to its strengths. Playing to its strengths is quite fun. I'm liking it. I feel, I, I just, I'm very, very scared because I'm in a pretty dire position right now. Like, I cannot take many hits at all. Whoa. The shop spawned. Okay, so we have a bit of a weird anti-synergy here. Having the, the bloody harvest um, active item... And also having this uh, item that spawns shops means that we're now spawning shops that cost HP. Which isn't what I expected, but there you go. Let's get more of the void ready. If these guys can just do their own thing. A pain in the ass. Rainbow Heart is potentially useful here. Right. Sig Monstro. Shouldn't be too bad. The one problem at the minute I'm really having is I just can't tell what's my tears and what isn't. I just have no idea when incoming tears are mine or not. Like, I got hit there. I don't even know by what. Okay, we got him. And it did spawn us some HP. Rather nice. I think we should go like that. Grab that. Shit, this is problematic. Do that. Do that. Right, now attempt to get in here without picking up a penny. In fact, I'm going to play it safe. It's kind of weird because I kind of would want that money, but we can potentially get better stuff by having no money. And I really want the damage ups. The damage ups are more important than anything else, really. Thanks for the troll bomb game. Immediately killed my ghost. Oh, we got a Hierophant. Okay, this was good. This was really good. The Satanic Bible. Oh, Satanic Bible would be very, very, very good. Because we'd get two black hearts of use out of it. I think I'll take it. I think I'll take it. It's just... 
th this thing's great, but it's messing up our shops and everything as well, like... Very nice if we could have all of them. Bob's Curse, rather nice. A twi okay, we might be able to afford that. A 20 cent wafer is more than worth it. So we'll, uh, we'll at least attempt to afford that. So unfortunately, my little Bebski is dead for this whole floor now. Right. Yeah, we'll see if we can get like a, a stockpile of money from somewhere. I doubt it. I doubt we can get 20 cent, but getting wafer would be super useful. And yeah, I'm going to say, just now that we've got Satanic Bible, we've basically won. <laughs> it's such a good item. Okay, so there's five cent. We'll leave it there for now. We want to kind of pick up all 20 in one go, really. And then we get Tonsil Shot. Yeah, we'll take Tonsil Shot. It can be a bit glitchy, a bit weird, but it's overall pretty good. It seems to be able to kill Charmed Familiars too, which is interesting. And hurt me? What hurt me then? Yeah, it just sticks our tonsil things around, like, every wall, which is pretty darn useful. Well, yeah, so far, so good on this run. I've actually got a tinted rock up here as well. Okay, so money-wise, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, so we're not quite there yet. We're getting there. We need, like, another seven cent, I think. Okay. This pretty much seals the deal for us, I think. Yeah, let's start picking up money now. Check out our shop real quick. We got a soul heart in here as well. Oh, don't these, like, function a bit differently? Yeah, okay. So, we got money there. I don't want to pick it up yet. And we're definitely going to end up doing some backtracking here. It's probably going to be a little bit annoying. But... We pick up that, so we're at six cent. Then we're up to fourteen. Okay, so no, we want one more cent from over there. Now we're at fifteen cent. We can go back this way, and this will give us the wafer. We've got a nickel back over this way, if you remember correctly. Oh, we had some pennies in this room as well. I forgot about these. Could have, I could have avoided backtracking there if I just looked at my map. Yeah, now we got 20 cent, so we can buy the wafer. Look how slowly my fire is going down at this point. <laughs> yeah, now we can buy this, and we're now at zero cent. I am loving this as a play style. Like, to try and get the most out of this item, I'm having to very much change up how I would normally play, and it's very interesting. I've ne like I said, I've never really played to its strengths before. Do you know what? We can we can grab all of this money. Because there's stuff in the shop that we want. We can grab all this money. And then we can grab the money that's here as well. One and two. We're up to ten cent. We only need five more. I think we can bomb the mum's dresser a few more times as well. We've got a few cent in there already. We can grab this guy. 12, 13, 14, 15, and get burger bombs. Hey, I like it, I like it. Now we'll get our damage up and our reward. Pop that again. So many black hearts. Ooh, we got some coffins in here. I can't remember how these coffins work. It's, is it that you bomb them twice? Okay, it is, yeah. You bomb them twice. This one gave us three burn hearts, which I actually don't think we want. This one also gave us three burn hearts. Yeah, I don't think we want burn hearts right now. We're, we, we've got a very good setup. Ow. Yeah, I jumped right on my forehead. 
I'm kind of tap shooting at the minute while we don't have our baby with us. Once we get our um, our ghosty back, I think spin wheeling is a is a little bit better of a tactic. But when we have less tears on the screen or less tears plausible, it doesn't matter as much. I'd rather just tap fire with 10 fire rate. Basically like having soy mill. Ow. Okay, we'll pop that. Okay, red mum's obviously annoying, but we shouldn't have too much of an issue. In fact, re with red mum, I think we do spin wheel here, just to charge up more of the void. More of the void's damage is just too important to us right now. Ow. Oh, stop with the eyes. We're doing the lamb here, so we'll grab that. And I'll have a look what we get here. Speed down. Devil items can appear in any pool. Tears for... Uh, tears up for each item that prevents fire. Okay, um... I'm relatively happy with that. Slightly lower speed, but... Devil deals can appear in any pool seems interesting. I know that we don't have much of the run left now where we can get items. Probably should have waited on that. Oh, well. We've got our ghost baby back now, though. We can start uh, using more of the void a little more actively. This is a slightly horrible room. We're good, we're good. And this should be a point where, as, unless unless it's blocking our path, it should be very, very easy for us to not take money. Oh, dude, he died again. How did I go so long without him dying? And then he's died twice instantly. I swear I went, I went like three full floors without him dying once. Now all he wants to do is die. It's his favorite thing in the world. It's death. Oh my lord. One, one thing I have to say, by the way, I know it's quite late in the episode to kind of talk about this, but I've been really appreciating all of you um, out there, like, answering these question of the days. Um, for one, it, it's it's really enjoyable to read them and, and just learn a bit about you guys. Um, I always I always really enjoy it, especially those of you that are asking questions back as well. That's even more enjoyable. I always like answering questions when I can, and viewers getting to know me a little better. But also, it's it's really helping out the channel. Like noticeably, the content is doing um, significantly better as of late. Uh, I'm getting like one po like b between one and two k views on pretty much every single Isaac episode. No matter what, no matter like what the content is, so I'm really, really liking the fact that that's going on. And yeah, like if you don't know, comments just when when YouTubers are like, "Oh, like, comment, and subscribe," it really helps the video. It it, it actually it, it does in ways that like are, are sort of behind the scenes. One of the biggest ways is that um, the search engine optimization, the SEO, gets boosted quite a lot. Essentially, if your video has high levels of interaction, so like a lot of comments for how much views it has, which I think my videos are doing really well at, thanks to you guys. I have a very high level of comments um, as opposed to the amount of views. The the, the ratio is really good. Um, yeah, uh, when, when you have a high level of that, YouTube tends to give your um, give your videos like a recommendation to other people a bit more often. So it's super, super nice to see that doing really, really well. And I just got to say thank you because it's... I'm, I'm still really enjoying playing Isaac. I don't know when I'll ever stop because I just... I still enjoy it. Um, and honestly, a lot of people on YouTube at the minute... I mean, Alexa did a video about it. BD1P has been talking about it. And there's just various different people that have been talking about how, unfortunately, Isaac is kind of falling out of the viewership space on YouTube. Not as many people are watching... Um, are watching Isaac as they used to be, but somehow my co my comment uh, my content is kind of thriving on it. Whoa, um, I don't think any of those are going to be really for us, are they? Uh, but yeah, my content my content's kind of thriving with um with ent with uh, Isaac right now, and I'm really glad for it because it's the content that I make it uh, that I enjoy making the most. It's like I've said qu quite a few times before. It's just one of those games for me where it's really chill to just sit down and record and like get stuff off my mind, and it helps me sort of relax and chill out. Okay. Right. Baby Plum, do 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 do. You died again, sir. Why don't you get behind me rather than sitting in front of me? At this point, I feel like he wants to die. Okay. 
Keep her going. It's kind of crazy as well that over the course of this run, we've only had two real damage upgrades, and both of them not even being that big of damage upgrades. And yet, we've managed to get ourselves into a position where we have eight damage. Like, we, sh we should, considering you start with lower damage in the sky, we should be at around five right now. But because we've done so many flaws of gaining that damage up, it's a real stellar way to play. Like, the extra, like, bonus consumables are just, like, an added benefit, but, like, with the damage plus that, in a really good spot. Also, as well, I've got to say, like, we've got Wafer right now. That's just insane. <laughs> the Wafer's one of those vanilla items that you're like, god damn, for anyone that can get to the womb reliably, it is just, like, one of the best items in the game. It just literally doubles your amount of health. I will take the duplicate, just in case. It's a look down. We only just got that look up, so I don't really mind about losing that. Okay. Oh god, I got double hit there. It's okay, though, because we can easily get back up to full health. I'm honestly not even caring about... Like, having the wafer plus a car battery... Um... Okay, let's just check this out first. Sulfur... Gives us brimstone for a bit. Our contract from below is really good. Um, yeah, having... That would have actually given us double brimstone there. Having the doubled up um, satanic bible plus wafer essentially means we have to get hit. I did pick up money there, unfortunately, so we might as well commit. Um, yeah, essentially means that we'd have to get hit how many times? One, two, three, four. Four times in six rooms in order to... Well, actually five times. Five times in six rooms in order for that to be a problem. Also, this guy just took my money away from me, so thank you. Like, we essentially cannot die unless we seriously fuck up. We would have to, like, majorly fuck up. Also, yes, we... we then there might need to be a fix to make sure Tonsil can't kill your own familiars, because that's happening reasonably often. <laughs> I've got Perkigo, and the reason we never see any familiars is because I instantly kill them with Tonsil. He's dead again. He just doesn't like life. Like, I got hit a ton there, and I still just made up more health than I lost. Ooh, intriguing little room there. Okay, that brimstone boy did us in, did that guy in for us. Keep Remington to pop our active here. The Book of Despair. Ow. Steam sale can be in conception. I mean, I might as well grab steam sale here. Unfortunately, does it does it not take effect on these? It does not. Okay, unfortunately, we're not affording them anytime soon, then. Although, I think future purchases, it will work. This is a terrible idea. Actually, it was bad. It wasn't terrible. It was nowhere near as bad as I expected it was going to be. In fact, I am somewhat baffled by the fact that we didn't get hit there. There was four little Lurkies in that room. <laughs> Right, pretty much boss is right on us here. Two or three more rooms, I think. Go, book of despair again. Book of the chair. I'm loving this spinning wheel setup as well. Easy kills from those guys. This dude's got a soul heart for us. Cell heart here. Pop that. See, I've been getting hit like a ton, and I just got back up to full HP. <laughs> Ooh, we got brimstone boys here. Ooh, saw blades. Now, saw blades were glitched last time we grabbed them, so I don't even know if they're worth grabbing. Not that we can anyways. I mean, there's the quarter all the way back there, but we can forget about the quarter. So we just fought you, so we don't really care. And then this guy should go down nice and quickly. I love uh, baiting out that brimstone. Oh my god, I think I'm just a little too small for him to hit there. The tears went right over my head. Not had that before. After this, I'm going to go and ha get myself some lunch. I don't know what to get. What do you guys think? Leave a comment to what I should get for lunch. Bear in mind. <laughs> That's like the stupidest thing I've ever said. Like, <laughs> this video is recorded like two weeks in advance. And you guys are going to be like, 
Hey, turtle, do you, know, do you know when you had lunch like two weeks ago? You should have this. And I'm gonna be like, the fuck are you talking about? Because I'll completely forget that I asked you guys to leave this comment. I, that's one thing that I kind of like doing to myself. Um, <laughs> I like, uh, I find it really funny to like say something in a video, like ask you guys something. Um, because normally, because I pre-record and I usually have like a quite a quite a hefty backlog, I completely forget what I said in previous episodes. So I'll get all these comments and I'm like, "What the fuck's going on? Like, why are people talking about like camels or something?" And I'm like, "What's with all these weird comments?" <laughs> and then I like I have to like go back and watch the recording. Go, oh, I asked a really weird question. That's why. That's another really fun thing about, like, the question of the day. Because I have a pretty hefty backlog, I don't get the replies to the question of the day for, like, two weeks. So by then, I kind of forget the question, um, which means it's even more enjoyable to read the answers. Goddamn, who'd have thought? 21 fire it. Beautiful. Still no chest dropped. We have contract from below, so I was hoping for a few chest drops here, but... Looks like what shit out of luck. I am really playing this so, like, cavalier. I just don't care about being hit whatsoever. It's so impossible for me to die. These runs, it's weird that these runs can, like, pop up in vanilla. I feel like these runs were a little more common when it came to, um... When it came to Afterbirth Plus, with like Book of Revelations and Satanic Bible just being inc incredibly insane. Like I remember one run as well, where I had, um, I had, ooh, I kind of would want that. Can I, can I manage to get that? I don't know if I can, can I? Um, there was, there was one run I had where I had, um, a, what was it? I think I had a Hierophant card, plus Blank Rune. No, plus blank card, sorry. Um, plus car battery, and I had something else as well. And every time I used my active, it produced... Oh, that was it, tarot cloth. So every time I used my active, it produced eight soul hearts on a six-room charge. It was obscene. <laughs> Obviously, that can't be done anymore. But that was still a really funny one <laughs> when that happened. Ooh, I do want to try check out a horse pill. Just because um, in the le latest update of Ipecac, horse pill variants of the um, Ipecac pills were added, and I did a voiceover for one of those. Invested. Damn. Wasn't one of mine. Yeah, I did, I did a voiceover for some of the uh, some of the, the mega pills, and I think they're really good. <laughs> right, let's go back here and buy uh, this. So, if we fire this way, we get fire. Fire this way, we get bouncy. This is the one we want. We want to be constantly just firing this way. If we fire up, we get... I don't know. If we fire down, we get... I don't know. <laughs> so we just fire right for bouncy. Oh my god, the brimstones. The overwhelming amount of brimstones. Up to full health again. Right, let's try and plop this in the right spot. Yeah. Eternal Heart. I don't think that's something we need, really, is it? Okay. It's kind of an interesting room. I'm going to say it's going to hit me a few times, but I don't mind. Right. You're going down, son. I can just, like, chill around him here. Just keep doing circles. Doesn't matter if I'm walking directly into him. Who cares about that? <laughs> oh, what a beautiful run. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. What a what a fun little run we had there. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.